What's going on, all my lovely ladies and gentlemen? This is Manufactured Opinion here, bringing you some more Borderlands 2 awesome sauce. And today I am showing you where to grab my favorite pistol in this game, and in my opinion, one of the best pistols in this game, and that is the Maggie. And the Maggie drops off of Mick Zafford outside of the Lynchwood train station in the dust. Now, in order to farm Mick Zafford for this weapon, you will need to do a couple of things. One, you will need to grab the quest Clan War from the bounty board in Sanctuary and follow that quest line all the way to the end until you reach this point where there is an epic shootout between the tiny little Irishmen and the crazy ass bandits. Now, the game is going to give you a choice to side with the crazy ass bandits or the tiny little Irishmen. What you're going to want to do is side with the Hodunks and kill the tiny little Irishmen. Now, the reason you want to do this is because if you kill the bandits, Mick Zafford won't respawn out the outside of the train station in order for you to farm him. So, like I said, make sure that you side with the Hodunks at the end of this quest line. I just don't want there to be any confusion. Now, this was particularly difficult for me, seeing as how I'm half Irish, um, and I had to kill tiny little awesome cute Irishmen over and over and over repeatedly, but uh, I eventually got over it, so... Make sure you do that, and then obviously you're going to use the tried and true method of saving and quitting and killing Mick Zafford over and over repeatedly, and I'm going to show you my favorite way to do that. Okay, so the pretty crappy part about farming for this weapon is if Mick Zafford doesn't drop the Maggie when you save and quit and reload, you spawn all the way back at Ellie's garage, but honestly, this is the best possible way I've found to kill the Irishmen as fast as possible so you can get your Maggie as fast as possible. So what you're going to want to do is grab the Catapult Bandit Technical from the Catcher Ride, obviously head over to the Lynchwood train station and just lob barrels at the little Irishmen until they explode into tiny little pieces of Lucky Charms. And that's basically it, guys. I did try, um... You know, saving in Lynchwood and then taking the train over and then obviously you spawn right out, right outside there in the train station. But uh, I find that you can kill them a lot faster if you just have one of these uh, catapult bandit technicals. And obviously you want to kill them as fast as possible. You don't want to hide behind cover, shoot at them and then, you know, maybe die and then respawn and then you got to shoot at them again. You're better off just grabbing one of these, driving across the map and just lobbing grenades at them. And uh, that's the most efficient way possible I've found. If you guys know a better way, shoot me a comment in the comment section below. But yeah, blow up those tiny little Irishmen and cackle like the arson beetle. So once you farm Mick Zafford long enough, eventually, hopefully, if you have good enough luck, the Maggie will drop. Now, like I said at the beginning of this video, this is by far my favorite pistol in this game. And I actually had a lot better luck farming this weapon in the second playthrough, the true Vault Hunter mode. Now, this holds true for all loot in the game. You will have a lot better chance of finding it in your second playthrough. So if you haven't started true Vault Hunter mode, I highly recommend that you go ahead and do that because actually, a lot of the white weapons, um, the white rarity weapons, I should say, are better than some of the orange weapons you find later on in the game in your first playthrough. So that is definitely something to keep in mind. And obviously, when I show off loot, I have to give it away. So make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below saying you want a sexy Maggie pistol. And I will randomize the names, uh, shoot you a message over um, YouTube. If you won, obviously you have to be on Xbox. Uh, give me your gamer tag. I'll add you as a friend on Xbox, and I will shoot you this weapon. Now, this is a level 40 weapon, uh, so just keep that in mind. I don't really know why you would need to keep that in mind, because even if you aren't level 40, eventually you will be, so you will be able to use this weapon no matter what. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I hope you're enjoying Borderlands 2 as much as I am, and as always, enjoy life, everybody. Uh, bye bye now.